Uh, well, what I'm doing here is trying to make some homemade yogurt. Somebody asked me to put a video on here of how I did this, so basically I brought some milk to a boil. I brought it real slow and you see you, so you can see the steam coming off of it. That's getting rid of the water. And then I let it cool down to about 125 degrees. I added a little bit of yogurt. Ah, uh, here we go. That's Dan and Plain Yogurt. You look on here and it says Live Cultures. That's what you want. It's a bacteria that's good for you. Make sure it's at room temperature before you mix it in. Okay, that way the cultures start growing again, right? Put you a couple tablespoons of that in there. And I guess I used about a half a gallon of milk because I made a whole bunch of it. And then actually added about four or five tablespoons in there, mixed it up. And then I added some some honey and stuff in there and as you can see I used all different kinds of containers okay and what I'm doing with them now is I put them in here on top of the heating pad right then I'm gonna wrap them up in a towel so they stay nice and warm and I got this insulated container I'm gonna zip it up and then I'm going to leave it there overnight. So I hope you can see all this. I got the heating pad set on medium. What I did, I took a candy thermometer and I wrapped it in the heating pad, set it on high and it said like 150 degrees which was too high so I turned it down to medium. Uh, so it would be about 120 degrees and that's it uh, after that sets for like eight hours you could take it put it in the refrigerator and then it'll uh, another culture will kind of grow and that'll set it now if you keep go messing with them things it'll be liquid it won't be solid like you want it uh, one other thing I wanted to show you you know I've been doing a video about my little plant starter I bought well I went and got Chinese food the other night and look at that and that and that pan on bottom clear on top pan on bottom clear on top so if anybody wants to have a seed starter don't go out and spend twelve dollars on one at Walmart like I did. Take your girlfriend out to eat, bring it back home, and you got two seed starters and a happy girlfriend. Thanks for watching.